Hey everybody, this is Alpha Zero at Service. I'm gonna do a review on a new episode of Mahoka that just came out minutes ago, or should I say one hour ago or so? Well, minutes ago I would say, because since it's like um eleven fifty five and I thought it was twelve right now. And this episode was pretty pretty interesting. I mean it had a lot of action, maybe a little bit like in progression, and that ending hella of freaking surprised the hell out of me, you know. I was told millions of times to go read the light novels, you know, but you know but you know me, I have like a but you know me, I have a lot of stuff to take care of, especially at school, and I don't really have much time of it, you know. And that's the but that's the one thing I have to be honest with you all about, you know. And when I looked at this episode, I thought it was pretty cool, you know. Never thought it was gonna happen that way, and I get to see a more crazy, gory side of Tatsuya, you know. I guess it's like um he would just do. I guess like um he would just kill anybody whoever whoever gets in his way or tries to harm his sister, you know. That's the one thing I will say in my mind and my own opinion because that's my own ideals. So if anything else, I'll just get started right now. Okay, at the beginning we have that the Yokohama district is being attacked right now. And so far a bunch of punks did invade the room where the students are. And right now like um, one of the guys telling everyone to drop the CAD except Tatsuya. He doesn't listen and the guy shot him. But Tatsuya ends up using a technique and then he... Got in the bullet and then crushed it. Used some kind of like um crazy um te magic technique and he killed he killed the guards no matter what and everyone apprehended the guards and later on everyone decided to go, like Tatsuya's friends decided to go with him to go after something. Cardinal George was actually surprised like um what kind of technique was that? How'd you do it? And you know what? Like, and you know like um. He said, what the hell will it matter anyway? I have no time to debate with you whatsoever. And I go like, dang, that's the first time I've seen him kind of like yell a bit. No, even though it wasn't really yelling, just in my own eyes and the way how I heard it, uh, the way how it's adapted, it's just like, what the hell? <laughs> and later on, um, Mayumi Sagusa decides to tell like A-chan it's her turn to like um, do something. And therefore, Mayumi made an announcement to everyone. And therefore, like um, A-chan is now responsible is gonna keep an eye on everyone and so far Leo wanted to go fight you know but Tatcha says oh they're using anti-magic bullets and then like um move them out of the way and he asked Miyuki to help him out to stop the bullets and later on they all turn frozen ice and this is where Tatcha uses it this crazy magic again uses uses his magic and slicing them all apart using his arms and I'm going holy motherfucker dude Erica ends up having some fun and Miki too and I go like oh wow dude pretty crazy intense and therefore, information was relayed like um that the freaking like um no head dragons I believe or some or some kind of group whatsoever is like attacking everywhere so far. And later on, everyone ends up having a me everyone ends up meeting each other and they end up going to the green room, somewhat. And I think that was a truck that was about to hit them, you know. But looking for um Tatsuya, he managed to know what the heck was going on and he shot that truck down. And I'm going. What the hell? What made him like him so so like overpowering or something? Even my even one of my friends even one of my one of my friends or YouTubers YouTube my YouTube viewer told me tells me that he's like a god or something you know just leave it at that. I go like, OP whatever and therefore like um after everything that's been happening so far um Tatsuya is ordered to like um go and boost up the defense since he's like one of these special special soldiers whatsoever. Even everyone is surprised. Miyuki on the other hand was kinda worried like shit just by looking at her face or something, you know? Therefore, Miyuki ends up deciding to give him one thing. And I thought she was gonna kiss him in the lip, but I'm going, Oh boy, here it comes and then but she kisses him on the head and she says like um you're free to you 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 have free reign now. Like um you can go what do whatever and Tatya says I'll be on my way now and That'll be about it. Now, I understand this review is short, maybe because like there's nothing much I can say or talk about. Of course, there's, there's much I can say and talk about, but I'm better off letting you guys take a look at the episode than me, like, um, telling you and explaining it to you in a very long way. And I know, like, um, my reviews are coming short, and I apologize for that. It's just like, um, I don't know, you know, there are some things that it's worth talking and some things that aren't. And I know I should be reading the light novels by my friends millions of times, but I go like, you know, I have school and so forth, and I got this hobby to take care of, you know, and other things too. So if I ever got the time, I'll have my chance to read it, you know. And I'll have to read it soon, as soon as possible, and so forth. And I'll see how how things are at, you know. 
So that'll be about it. I'll see y'all later and I'm off of zero and I'll see you on my next video, right? Peace out. Bye bye. Later.